Top 10 best fast food items of all time. I have to know, you guys. Okay, number one has to be McDonald's fries. Number six, McDonald's french fries. What? What the hell is that? What? Six? Two. It's gotta be a Whopper. bunch. Burger King. Whopper! Number one's gonna be Big Mac, and it's not. Number it's one, Big Mac. It's Big Mac. This, this sandwich is an abomination. Do better right now, lightning round. Do better right now? Hold on. Fast food item tier list. Dude, this is too many. Uh, Domino's is pretty good. Baja Blast is high. Hot dog's low because it's, it's pig butt. Breakfast sandwich is pretty good, but they're always a little bit too filling. Crunchwrap Supreme is always good. Great snack. I think this is a deluxe sandwich. Don't like the Monterey Jack cheese. Baconator is kind of high, but it's way too filling. I'm going to put it up with Domino's. This looks disgusting, but I would eat it once as novelty. I think it's a fried chicken in between two donuts. Chick-fil-A fries are always good. Don't be mad at me. It's just they're, they're good all the time. I don't know what this is. Is this Long John Silver? It's a parfait. I don't want to eat that. Popeye's fries are gross. The seasoning is too much. This looks like two tacos stacked against each other. That seems pretty nice. Sonic drinks are great. Uh, apple pie, not a fan, but that's just a personal thing. Pretzels, pretty good. I'll get them if I'm at the mall or if I'm shopping or something and need some quick carbs, but that's not bad. Uh, tacos, a classic all the time, always. White Castle, don't have, never had. So I'm going to put that there. Doritos have never had it. Cinnabon, way too big. I'm going to put it down here. It's honestly a little bit too big. I can't eat the whole thing. And Marcus used to get two of them. Pink Fresh, it's insane. Roast Beef Sandwich, I think this is from Arby's. Very filling, always hits the spot. Sometimes you're just in the mood for it, and I'm going to put it a little bit higher. Blizzard is okay, but I would just rather go to an ice cream place. I don't know what this is. I think it's a filet of fish, and that's gross. Double Down, I never had the chance to try. Actually, yes, I did, and it was okay. It wasn't as bad as people said, but it's still at the lower end. Uh, Dunkin' Donuts is just donuts donuts are hard to mess up donuts i'll put a little bit higher they're not as good at Krispy Kreme, but they're pretty good Krispy Kreme is definitely higher mcdonald's fries are the apex for a reason they're going always going to be the strongest everybody loves mcdonald's fries checkers fries too too the seasoning is too much it's annoying it fills up your whole mouth i really don't like it chicken fries are okay pretty decent but again having a chicken uh condensed into a cylinder into a pipe kind of weirds me out i don't really like that i'm already eating pink goo or pink sludge. I'm not gonna, I, I don't like the fact that it's like a stick. Frosties are pretty decent, but again, it's like Blizzard. I would just rather go get ice cream. Never had whatever this is. Chick-fil-A sandwich is excellent. I mean, come on, you know, it's, it, it, it launched a billion restaurants and everybody loves it. KFC bowl is disgusting. I can't believe that they pass this off for food. They just give you a bowl of stuff and they just dump all of it together. KFC fries, hate it. I don't like wedges. KFC chicken, though, is actually pretty good. Not quite as good as Popeye's, but I don't know. They're mostly the same. This one's okay. I don't know why Burger King got the long chicken, but it's pretty good if you get no mayonnaise. There's a little bit too much mayonnaise. Never had a McRib. I've always wanted to try it. McDonald's nuggets are good unless they get cold or if they're not crispy. If they're crispy, they go up a tier. If they're not, then they go a little bit lower. Hash browns are okay, but really they just fill up the thing so they can't just give you one item. Don't like subs. I assume this is Jimmy John's. Don't really like it. Papa John's is decent. Uh, above Domino's, I think. I don't like Domino's crust, but it's a little bit higher. Pizza Hut, I actually like most of the chains, but obviously if you're going to the chains, you could probably do better with a local place. This is Popeye's Chicken. Uh, definitely higher. I would probably put it up here, but I don't know about you guys, but you gotta be in the mood for fried chicken. You have to be in the mood for fried chicken all the way through to really get it. I feel like I get it once a season, like once every three months, and not really beyond that. White Castle is not my area. I've had it like twice. I don't remember. McGriddle is good if you want to fuck up your whole day. This is a choice that you make at the beginning of your day. It's like your first choice in a roguelike is like, I'm going to eat something delicious now that will put me either in a great mood or will give me a sugar crash, the likes of which I've never seen at 1 p.m. This is either a huge buff or a massive nerf. It's a good mood, but it's also a disaster at noon. You gotta be sure that you want that McGriddle. There have been so many times that I've been in the McDonald's drive-thru, I'm like, what am I gonna get? And I just get the sausage McMuffin, because I'm like, I don't want to deal with the McGriddle. I'm d I, d I can't deal with a stat debuff today, I'm too busy. No for hot dogs, not a hot dog guy, which I said before. The Quarter Pounder! Quarter Pounder go crazy. Quarter Pounder is very high, I will give it up. Uh, what is this? McMuffin? McMuffin also go crazy. It's not too big, it's not too excessive, it's right on the line. Excellent, very good. Burger King fries, way better than people say. They get a bad rep. Uh, I'll put them in A, and I might shift these around. Asiago Ranch Chicken Club. I don't trust anything that sounds this fancy, and I'm not kidding. If I go to a fast food place, I want a chicken sandwich or a burger sandwich or something like that. If you say it has Asiago, I've already tuned out. If I'm going to get this fancy pants bullshit, I would rather go to someplace fancy, like Applebee's. 
I would go to some place that I'm going to sit down. I'm not going to a drive through and I'm asking for Asiago or Acai. It's disgusting. Popeye's chicken sandwich is actually better uh, than people give it credit for, I think. But you could just get the breading surprise. <laughs> there, there is an issue with Popeye's where sometimes the sandwich that you get is just breading. Oops. It's just oil. You just ordered oil. My bad. Uh, Big Mac is disgusting. Too much bread. Not good. I don't know what the fuck this is. But this is just sugar. It's like onion rings and soda and donuts, whatever. Wendy's fries are deplorable. Uh, a Whopper is... God damn, look at this picture. Dude, look at that meat. This, this is criminal. This should be illegal. This is insane. How could you call this a burger? I hate the Whopper, dude. Look at that! It is legitimately one-tenth of the whole burger. Do you see that? Uh, and whatever they see. I don't know what this is. What is this? I don't know what this is. It looks gross. It looks like mushrooms on a burger. I would never eat a mushroom. You know mushrooms grow out of the ground, right? Disgusting. Anyway, this is the list. It's not ordered. Uh, it could probably be ordered better, but you get it. I'm uploading this vid with a time split. Live split timer edited in tomorrow. Don't put this on the internet, because then people are going to think that this is gospel. They're gonna be like, oh my god, I can't believe you put McNuggets under ch chicken fries. And that's not true. McNuggets are better than chicken fries, as we all know. And Papa John's, that's not Papa John's, it's Popeye's. Pa There's two pops, that's why I got it wrong. It's a little bit higher. Also, people are gonna look at this donut Remember thing and laugh at Wendy's me. Remember when Wendy's put an egg on a baconator and said, yep, that's breakfast. Wait, did they do that? They just put an egg on the bacon? You can put an egg on anything, and you're just like, yep, they're a hearty breakfast to wake up to. Delicious. Good. Terrific. Kind of smart? No, it's not. What are you talking about? That's smart? To put an egg on something? You're like, yep, that's breakfast food. Delicious. Honestly, though, I do like, I do like eggs on things. So that's kind of for me, honestly.